Good morning everyone. Today I want to present about what is inherent safety. Inherent safety is a philosophy in engineering design stage of material processing plants where the hazard being eliminated at the earlier stage. Since perfect safety is unable to achieve, inherent safety avoid hazards instead of controlling them. The control being done to reduce the hazard in the inherent safety focus on reducing hazard material and reducing hazardous operation in plant. Inherent safety concept has been introduced by Trevor A. Klutz in 1978 and he published the article entitled What You Don't Have Can't Leak. He based the this article from lesson from the Flix Borough disaster that occurred in June 1974. Flix Borough disaster occurred due to the failure of the cyclohexane plant that led to the disaster. A major li liquid from the reactor circuit caused the rapid formation of a large cloud of flammable hydrocarbon. In inherent safety, there are four major strategies being used. They are substitute, minimize, moderate, and simplify. For substitute, it is replacing the hazardous material with the less hazardous material. For example, a non-flammable solvent could replace a flammable solvent in a process. For minimize, minimize is reducing the hazard by using smaller quantity of hazardous material in a process. For example, hazardous material should be produced and consumed on site. This minimizes the storage and the transportation of hazardous raw material and intermediates. The next one is moderate. Moderate is a method that uses hazardous material under less hazardous condition. For example, refrigeration to lower vapor pressure uh, to overcome high pressure or Diluting solution to a lower concentration example to reduce its acidity. The last one is simplify. Simplify is a method that it eliminates the unnecessary complexity and it designed as a user-friendly plant. For example, containment being used within the process vessel Simplify the design by eliminating high pressure interlock system. This slide will explain about the hierarchy of process risk management strategies. In hierarchy of process risk management, inherent is the highest and the robust procedure or method or strategy while Procedural is the less effective strategies. As I mentioned, inherent, it is the method of removal or eliminate the hazard at a, at a early stage. The next one is passive. Passive minimize the hazard through process and equipment design features that reduce either the frequency or the consequence without the active functioning of any device. Example, dikes around storage vessel to contain spill. The next strategy is active. Active strategies require an active response. These systems are commonly referred to as engineering control, although it's human intervention. Example, water curtains to knock down gas release and flares. 
The last strategy is procedural, commonly referred to as administrative control. For example, establishment of policies, operating procedures, safe work practice, emergency response procedures, and training. This is my reference, the facts and contents, photo, sound. This is my last slide. Thank you.